Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Topics with me, where today we're going to be doing something just a little bit different. Now today, it is going to be different, but, you know, I'll explain it after the intro starts. Roll it. My name is Derek Amal, and I am proud to be. I'm in another town with my family, and so I found a place where everyone will be. Let's talk this week to Lee. This is Topics with me. So recently, I've been making more of these videos that have been more tech-related, but I decided today to kind of involve everything that I wanted to talk about because there's a lot of things happening in the world that people are not aware of, and I wanted to bring that to their attention. So we're going to go through a few big things that are happening in the world today, and we'll just we'll see how that goes, and if you guys like this type of you know, commentary, I will keep it going. If you guys like the singular topic type of commentary, I'll just, I'll stick back to it. But I'm, I'm trying new things, you know, I'm, I'm involving with the future. And yeah, we'll see how it goes. So for the Good Place fans, uh, it's a TV show that is highly popular on NBC. It is, it is at its last season and most people are upset about it. I know I am because I watched it from the time it came out. And I watched its spin-off series, um, The Office, Parks and Recreation, Brooklyn Nine-Nine that's involved in the whole... I'm not, I'm not exactly sure if it's in the whole universe thing, but basically news comes out on it that the experiment running for the, um, for the people that have been tested for humanity's sake... I'm not going to explain too much into it. Uh, the test is finally over and we're ready to see what will happen in the next episode. It's not the series finale, but we're ready to see what will happen. So if you guys aren't aware, um, on YouTube we have the trending page. And that's actually where I get some of my uh, reaction ideas from. Because that is the place where everyone's looking down to kind of be trending. I, I want to also be modern, so I... I I do it on relevant things because I always update my episodes. I want it to become more relevant. So uh, generally, I looked on the trending page and number two on it was a song called Follow God by Kanye West. And it seems pretty similar to God's Plans, which was created by Drac, the, the, the Drake. And he is following, uh, is, uh, he had a interview and apparently he said he wanted to promote the idea of having inspiration to go on in life but I, I watched the video myself and I couldn't I can't tell you what he said within the video but gen generally yeah I also heard that um, personally that because I work at McDonald's Frozen 2 is out and people have been talking about Frozen for years they thought they, they thought it would come out two years ago and now it'd be at its third movie but it took longer for the production to go up about and Frozen 2 is now I guess one of the largest movies talked about, at least on the internet community, and it is just... I We actually went back to watch the movie with Dane and Divya, and they seem to enjoy it, and I, I seem to enjoy it too. It just... It's, it was a nice collaborative movie. I watched it a little too late back when it came out, but it was a nice movie. I recommend that you guys watch it if you guys didn't have a chance yet. So for the tech fans out there, we have actually quite a bit in news. The Surface Pro X was released and it has re mixed reviews because of its past Surface releases with the Surface Go and the Surface 1 and 2 not having good RAM management usage. We also have AT&T switching customers to more expensive um, plans that are not prepaid. Not prepaid customers, but it's postpaid customers being switched to plans without asking them or informing them first, which does not seem fair because my mom's on AT&T and uh, although she's on the prepaid version, I heard that they're going to roll out with those uh, prepaid price increases, kind of like rent on a place that you haven't re released yet. So Disney Plus is coming out, and if you guys don't know what Disney Plus is, if you guys have the Netflix, or the, the Hulus, or if you guys are still very large fans of Xfinity and you have Xfinity 1, which I wish we did still have Xfinity 1, basically Disney Plus is kind of rivaling to become the biggest competitor in streaming services. And while Disney does own everything from 20th Century Fox to Marvel to pretty much 
anything that you can really think of except for like a select few. And Apple's former CEO that died, Steve Jobs, did own a part of the company. Technically, Apple does own a lot of entertainment, which is why they started Apple Plus. But without Apple's knowledge, Disney Plus started and it's going to be a rivaling competitor to Apple Plus, Apple TV Plus, sorry. And we'll, just, we'll have to see how that goes, but most people think that Apple Plus is not going to make it. I probably won't get it because it, it doesn't satisfy what I like watching. Uh, apart from that, the last piece of news is going to be on technology. An Apple store employee actually got fired for stealing like photos from someone's phone when they were supposed to be fixing the phone. Which is odd because I was actually going to go and... Um, you know, eventually I was going to fix a few problems that I had with my device at the moment. And I'm I'm now scared of, of doing that because I read these things. I tell you these things. I research. I do all these types of stuff to inform you guys. And me, myself, I have to be worried too. It's not like I can just go out and tell you and not follow the things myself. So if you guys are going by any Apple stores, be careful. Okay, be careful. I mean, there's no way to really be careful because they're taking your phone in the back. But just try to like, just, just try. Just, just try. Please subscribe, like, comment, and share. And look out for the 3,500 3, subscriber special. I keep saying 300. I really appreciate you guys' support. And I hope that you have a fantastic day. Have a wonderful day. Have a wonderful week. Have a wonderful Thanksgiving, Cyber Monday, Black Friday. And I'll see you guys when I see you guys. Buh bye okay? And just so you guys know, uh, next week is DK Vlogs. We're gonna go back to normal. Don't worry. Don't worry.